Hello, Nathan Wetzel here with Airframe Components. Uh, today's topic of discussion is uh, Service Bulletin 84-17, dealing with the 100 series and 200 series horizontal stabs, the rear attach fittings. In this Service Bulletin, it has you look at the aluminum boxes on the rear attach fittings of the stabilizers. With the aluminum boxes, you'll start to see, you'll be looking at for cracking issues that develop around the bolts for the rear attach with these aluminum boxes. If the cracks develop, you'll want to take care of them pretty soon. If, if let go, you'll see cracks develop in the spar. And then at that point you need to, you'll have to take the entire spar apart and change the, the spar out. To rectify the problem, Cessna has introduced a steel box to replace the aluminum boxes on the, for the rear attach uh, fittings on the spar. This here is the aluminum box. It has four sides. This is the new steel box that has three sides. Plus you want to make sure that it has been welded. This is a welded uh, flange right here. To gain access to being able to install these new bracket, new steel brackets, you'll need to use, uh, you'll need to use driven rivets and not blind rivets to attach these. To gain access to that, you'll have to drill all the rivets around the center section skin and remove it. And then you're easily, you can remove the aluminum box that was there. Make sure that you use some type of epoxy primer to, uh, to put a barrier between the dissimilar metals between aluminum and the steel. And then you're able to install that box or the bracket on the rear spar and be able to easily access with a bucking bar the tails of the rivets and be able to access with the rivet gun uh, to install those with driven rivets. Once, the, once your boxes are installed riveted on there with solid rivets, you can then install the center section skin back on with solid rivets all the way around the perimeter of it. 